Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your 30th of November read start from the 15th through the 21st of November 2021. This reading is going to be for the sign of Leo. So let's see what is going to be for Leo's for the 30th of November time. I will be adding Oracle cards in this reading, uh, so stay tuned. And now while I shuffle the cards, let me remind you, it is a general read. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the signs and messages that uh, resonates and leave the rest for personal reads you can always reach out to me on the email id in the description box you can also uh, check out other services that are offer as well in the description box so leos let's see how this week is going to be for all of you out there let's begin king of cups the empress Page of Pentacles, the Devil, Ten of Swords, and the High Priestess. Page of Swords, Six of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. I mean, the deck we do have the Ace of Cups. So somebody is definitely um, looking at someone from a pressure perspective. Um, I feel like you know this this connection that you have in your life right now with a specific someone um it is something which has been very sexual it is something that you have been into for quite some time but you were never ready to confess your love to your specific someone it can be the reverse energy for some of you just be mindful of that uh but yes i feel like you know, there has been something in this connection that you have with your specific someone that was stopping this connection from moving forward but right now i feel like you know in this week time I do see miraculous changes happening and I feel like you know for majority of you the miraculous changes that are happening are manifested by the divine uh, feminine here in this connection um, for some of you it could be the opposite but for majority of you I do see the divine feminine is the one who was so fucking sure about this connection ever since they got into this connection with you or you got into connection with someone else as well I feel like you know, the divine feminine here is the dominant one in this connection. She knows what is happening in this connection and what is going to be the ultimate future of this connection. So I feel like you know, for a majority of you, this connection is being manifested by the divine feminine there. Uh, this connection has always been very toxic. Uh, it's, uh, it seems like the toxicity in this connection came in with the obsession, um, possessiveness, madness extreme uh, passion in this connection that one had for the other person um i feel like you know for majority of you i feel like you know, this connection has been very much like one-sided because it was more of a sexual connection than anything else uh love emotion had been maybe missing in this connection uh from one side for sure uh one person was always you know so fucking sure of this connection but at the same time um this connection had its ups and downs for sure it had the great share of that in this connection you might have been together for quite some time uh but it seems like you know in this week time the love the feelings are going to get you know expressed by the divine masculine to the feminine and i feel like you know, it's more of a new chapter that you're going to start together as the divine masculine is going to open up about their true feelings to the feminine um where they are going to put an end to the toxicity that was added in this connection because of the one-sidedness of the connection uh and then you're both going to agree to the point that yes we both are ready for this connection to be going to the next level so i do see our soulmate connection finally reaching its destination where you're going to start together leaving the past behind especially the toxicity behind to start a new chapter together which is going to be stable which is going to be love and fun filled um i feel like you know it's more of a miraculous beginning uh that you're going to be experiencing in this connection uh maybe maybe in in the recent times you felt like you know this connection is going to get over but somehow uh this week is going to prove everything wrong because this is something which is going to come up uh very unexpected maybe you are in no communication right now when we are doing this reading maybe you you know you feel like you know this connection is over already but then comes this person, express their love, tell you that um, I love you so much and I really want to take things to the next level with you. Why? Because they missed you. Why? Because they want you. Why? They, uh, because they couldn't stop thinking about you. So there is a lot of obsession, passion, love 
Uh, but yes, the stability was always missing. The, you know, expression of love was already uh, always missing in this connection. So I do see that coming in this connection between the two of you. Uh, let's see more cards here. Somebody was always running away from expressing. And now, uh, in this week time, that person is expressing it. For majority of you, I feel like you know, it's the divine uh, masculine who was running away. But it can be opposite for some of you as well. But it seems like, you know, the love is definitely coming in very strong. Uh, and it's, it's more like, you know, it's going to overshadow uh, anything and everything negative in this connection. The love that is going to be expressed is going to change everything in this connection. Um, it's, it's a beautiful, beautiful energy. It's a beautiful, beautiful week for the Leos out there. And the love is going to take cover this connection for sure. Um, I do see new beginning coming up for the two of you in this connection. Let's see more cards here. Let's see what else is happening in this week for the Leos. What else can you expect coming up for you for this uh, week time? Let me pick up the cards. Okay, so let's take all of them. Huh. I feel like you know the Divine Feminine had, had been very patient in this connection. Um, they, they were like, you know, following a plan or something to, to pursue, uh, to, to pursue this connection the way they wanted. Um, again, maybe, maybe, you know, even if we are talking about right now, maybe, you know, this person is silent right now in this connection, but yes, manifesting this connection exactly the way they want. So let's see more cards here. For those of you who are, uh, you know, somebody who's career oriented, I feel like, you know, your promotions are definitely destined to come in, in, the, in the days to weeks time. But at the same time, I feel like, you know, there is a little push, a little effort that you still need to put in there. Uh, you can, you can have whatever you want, but yes, uh, try to be more responsible and cheerful around whatever that you choose to do for yourself and for your life. Uh, I do see a beautiful news coming your way. A lot of success. Pe uh, public recognition is also coming up for the Leos out there. Um, again, it can be for some of you. Maybe the person that you are dealing with is somebody who's a, who's a public figure as well. That could be the case for some of you as well. Uh, falling in love and making a serious commitment to, the, uh, to someone. Uh, I do see it's a past person. Again, uh, don't give up on your connection, relationship. Because I do see a beautiful new beginning coming in. In, in this regard, in, in the same way connection that you have with a person, uh, try to, try to, again, try to keep yourself positive around it. Uh, even though I feel like, you know, right now, even if you are in no communication, everything is fucked up between the two of you, this week is going to prove to be the game changer for you, the life changer for you. Something miraculous is happening. How, why is not your part to think of? All you got to do is believe that beautiful things are coming up. How is not your concern or should not be your concern? Because the universe has miraculous ways to bring forth what we desire. So just believe in that. Let's see what else is the oracle guidance for you. A time to give rather than take for some of you could be dealing with a Virgo. It's time to release negativity for some of you. You could be dealing with uh, Scorpio as well. It's time for you to stop thinking negative. A win-win outcome is forecast for some of you. you. could be dealing with the Libra as well. So, uh, Leos, this is pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, beautiful week time. If it helped you, do like, share, and subscribe. And if you are willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, you can definitely check the description box for further details on that. And yeah, till I do the next read for you guys. Take care and bye-bye. <clears throat>